Hey guys, what's up? It's Ashley here. And <laughs> it's day number 24 of daily vlogging. Um, so I just wanted to take... <laughs> I'm like the worst. <laughs> so I just wanted to tell you guys that I started reading... <laughs> Yes, started reading the book last night. <laughs> this one. One to watch. <laughs> um, and I gotta say, so <laughs> it's <laughs> like I like it because it's like so relatable to me. Um like this could be my life minus the fashion blogging part. Because <laughs> clearly I got none of that going on. <laughs> um, so, if you remember, I told you it was about a um, plus-size fashion blogger who becomes the next Bachelorette. But uh, in the book, the show is called The Main Squeeze, but it's a Bachelorette. <laughs> um, so, the whole... So, I, I just made it to, in the part in the book where, like, it starts. I mean, so this, that's not really a spoiler because it's right there in the description of the book. <laughs> like, so, I'm not spoiling anything. But, so the whole, like, lead up to it is basically how crappy dating is <laughs> for, like, for, for, for me. <laughs> For me and other girls that look like me. Um, it's just really awful. It's really awful. Really bad. Um, but, like, all these things that are happening to her, it's basically, like, yeah, my life. And it's, like, <laughs> you know, um, you know, she wrote emails <laughs> that she never sent to these guys that she liked. And then, like, she was, uh, you know crushing on her friend I mean that hasn't been for a long time for me but still it's happened in my lifetime and um she like goes on these dates and the people who respond they just say all these awful things like real ugh, ugh. it's just bad it's bad it's bad no one wants it <laughs> and I mean I'm sure this happens to skinny girls too but it's just different <laughs> trust me so I just want to like um so like there is one part that really stood out to me because I was like yes this is my fear this is my biggest fear this is why I have fears is because people like this say this stuff and like yeah it's in this book and it's fiction because it's written in the book but but people say real things like this <clears throat> so this was like right after she was announced as the bachelorette and then, of course, the internet goes crazy because that's how the internet is. So, it's, like, very realistic. Minus, you know, whatever. So, um, someone wrote, like, I'm taking this like it's real life because, <laughs> like I said, even though it's fiction, it's these types of things really, really occur in the wild. And by wild, I mean internet, the wild internet. <laughs> Okay, so this is right after um, she was announced. Let me put on my glasses for dramatic effect, even though they're just they're just blue light glasses. <laughs> dramatic effect glasses. <laughs> why am I so stupid? See, this is really why I'm single because because of this <laughs> nothing else. <laughs> okay, so anyway, it says. Is this be stupid or just blind? No one's falling in love with her. Um, and then the next person says, I decay. I tie her down. Um, and, well, I don't know. I don't think our word is appropriate to say, but you know, you know, our word. <laughs> uh, then at least you wouldn't have to hear her talk. Rude. And then, and then the person responds, uh, you don't even need to R-word her because she'd never say no. And then 
the next person responds again with, that's the best part about, about fat girls. I mean, they use the word, the B word. You guys, I don't like to say bad words. Um, okay, so that's the best part about, about fat girls. Always grateful. Do you see what people think about us? It's just rude. No. But it's like, oh, oh, there was another part and I closed the book. But it's basically saying, let me take my glasses off. It's like, it's like, oh, they're not going to say no because they're just grateful that you give them a little bit of attention. And like, yeah, I like, yeah, you like the attention, but that's where the fear comes in is because you don't know if it's real or if it's like, like, this is me really real life talking. It's like, you don't know if it's real or if it's like just someone trying to play you and it's impossible to know the difference and that's what makes it really awful mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and like you fall into the traps you really do because you're like you start thinking oh maybe they really do like me but no no they never do they never like you well they never like me anyway um <laughs> so yeah so <laughs> I feel like this is like really personal even though I'm talking about a fictional book it's just really like it's really real and like this is these are my real feelings and like um so this first part of the book was actually very triggering to me like I was getting very upset reading it um just because like I know how all of this feels and I know how this girl feels and like um, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna keep reading it because I'm hopeful and I have to have hope and I have to hope that this turns out well for her. Like, I need it to turn out well for her. And then, Bachelorette, call me. <laughs> Alright, I'll talk to you later. Love you. Bye!